The Taxi and Limousine Commission wants to increase the flat rate fare for trips between JFK Airport and Manhattan, as well as add a flat rate for trips to and from LaGuardia. Lisette Nunez has more now on the reasons behind these potential changes. The next time you head to JFK or LaGuardia Airport, you may have to dig a little deeper into your pocket. New York City's Taxi and Limousine Commission is looking to increase the flat fee for a taxi between JFK and Manhattan from $52 to $65. Usually the taxi is supposed to be cheaper than like a Lyft or Uber, but at this point, the Lyfts and Ubers are cheaper, even at like 50 bucks. That's better than paying 65 for a taxi, so... I think I will probably not take a taxi. As a college student, I think it's like harder with like the prices rising, especially with like COVID and everything, like get people getting laid off from work. Under the proposal for the first time ever, a $39 flat fare will be established for trips between LaGuardia and Manhattan below West 110th Street and East 96th Street. I know anytime we're talking about adjustments to the taxi rates of fare, it's a complicated discussion. So we would really welcome your thoughts and comments. The commission says these proposals come as the taxi cab industry has drastically changed, citing impacts brought by the pandemic, a shift in driver availability, and growth in for hire vehicles. They say the proposal flat rates are meant to cover drivers' wait times at airport lots when they are not generating income. The New York Taxi Workers Alliance says the flat fee increase is long overdue. Given that drivers have not had a raise in 10 years, while during this time period inflation has begun to skyrocket, yellow cab drivers have really been taking a significant loss. And the public will have a chance to weigh in on these flat rate increases. A public hearing will be held on April 5th. At LaGuardia Airport, Lisette Nunez, Fox 5 News.